solve for x, we have 2x minus 6 plus 5 times x plus 1 equals minus 3x minus 21. So we have our 2x minus 6, and if you distribute the 5 onto the x, okay, and the 5 times the 1, bring down the equals in the next two terms, okay. Now 2x plus 5x is what? And negative 6 and plus 5 is a minus 1. That equals, bring the other, the other terms. Now we need to get rid of the smaller of these 2x terms, okay? What is smaller, a 7 or a negative 3? Well, negative 3 is the smallest, so that's what we're going to eliminate by doing the opposite of a minus 3, both here and here. So we get 10x, bring down the negative 1 and the negative 21, running out of space here. Let's copy that up here and scoot that over a little bit. Now we need to get rid of the number next to the x. What number is right next to the x? If you say 10, that's the coefficient. That number we get rid of last. So don't say 10 now. What number is next to the x? Other than the 10, you'd say the minus 1. That's what we're going to get rid of with the opposite of minus 1 here and here. 10x equals, and you owe $21, and you pay back a dollar, you still owe $20. Now we're going to get rid of the coefficient of the variable. The variable's x, the coefficient is minus 10, so I will divide both sides by 10. x then equals minus 2. 